We found a treat that has people hooked. Mm. Pookie Crack Cakes in Bridesville has lines down the street, and they're selling out every single day since they opened their doors. And basically, what? basically, we just cut the line. Yeah, we have we Deidre, cut the line. Deidre and Douglas here with the infamous street. Okay, so I've heard about this street. I've seen the lines. So, what made you start a cake business? Well, um, at the time that I started a cake business, I was working in actual pharmaceutical. I was doing quality control in pharmaceutical. And so I was just doing this on the weekends. Like, I was a very good cook, but I wasn't a good baker. So I was like, you know what, let me start experimenting and trying different cakes and yeah. different things. And so the first cake I came up with was the my signature, which is the butter pecan praline. Okay. And well, I put, well, let's cut that. Oh, yeah, let's, let's, cut, let's keep talking. talking. So is this keep a talking. is this a bunt cake? Is so this they a, yeah. started off as bunt cakes. Yes, okay. they okay. originally started off as bunt cakes, which we Ooh, call and uh, in our family a crack cake. Okay. Crack cake. Why do you call it a crack yeah. cake? Why? So my I thought it was because it's addictive, like, like crack. crack. <laughs> <laughs> so That's it's, what I thought it's it kind is. of like a meta. Mm. So it's like a metaphor wordplay. So oh, here's wow. the thing. Mm. My great grandmother, she's I'm from great. Clayton, Louisiana. Mm -hmm. um, my great grandmother used to make crack bunk cakes all the time. Mm -hmm. So she would make bunk cakes on Sundays mm. after we came from church. Okay. Um, and the, when the cracks form at the top of that bun cake, Rack. she would poke holes into that cake, mm. and she would pour like a rum glaze inside yes. and let it seep into the yes. That's yes. all a crack cake is. You got it. Cause Wait. we thought, yeah, we thought the other yeah. thing. Yeah. yeah. Who's this is pookie? so good. Are you pookie? No. <laughs> no. <laughs> Douglas is definitely no, pookie. Everybody's no. pookie. Everybody. Okay. Everybody. Pookie. Yeah. So, I'm so pookie. Mm. pookie is a term of endearment. Mm. So people yes. were always referencing mm. our business because when I was selling the cakes, I was selling them out of my house. And mm -hmm. so we would have lines and people would block off the street to mm. run up to the door to get their cakes. Mm -hmm. wow. So people would be like, you got a mm -hmm. crack line down the street. And we were like, wait a minute, <laughs> what? <laughs> and, and, and they were like, yeah, like what's going mm. on? And then people would start mm. Putting on well, Facebook, the Oreo? I'm gonna split it. Okay, <laughs> she's talking. They were I'm sorry. putting on Facebook how addictive it was. Yeah, and so we just kind of did a wordplay. Yeah. We mm. were like, you know what? Well, what does Pookie, Pookie really mean? Yes. So Pookie is just a term of endearment. But it's a, but, but but growing oh up in, in in various communities, mm. there's a lot of people named Pookie. There's mm -hmm. a lot of we we met a young lady online named name Pookie. Name Pookie. Exactly. Name's Pookie. Mm -hmm. Absolutely. Well, this has just been yeah. such a hit. The explosion must have been hard to keep keep up with in the beginning. Oh my God. Right? It was. Yes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. When we started out, uh, so we started July we 16th of karma. last year. Oops. And the first day we did a thousand cakes and we sold <gasps> out in three hours. What? Wow. Three oh my gosh. So, how many cakes do you do a day now? Roughly 600. Oh my gosh. Stop. And then some days, okay, yeah. let's go seven. Through. Yeah, so okay. So, we sorry. Got, what is it? Caramel. Yes. Caramel. I'm trying yeah. to caramel now. Caramel. So, red we velvet. have red velvet. Yes, we have a key lime. We have a strawberry lemon. Mm. We have a vanilla bean lemon. Mm. We have mm. our signature, which is the butter pecan praline. Mm -hmm. We have Our, a pineapple, pineapple, yeah, paradise, pineapple paradise, and then we have a peach cobbler, <gasps> and which then we is, have and then my we favorite. Have my husband's Look favorite, the Oreo cookie drink. Oreo, really yeah, go. Oreo is really, that's my favorite. I'm an Oreo man. Me too, man. <laughs> I'm an my Oreo favorite. man. I like the Oreo. There's like a salty sweet going on. Oh, yes, yes. Mm -hmm. it's yes. delicious. It's a good. And balance. then you get the fruit, so these are Caramel? healthy. Those here. are health cakes. Fruit. That's a serving of fruit. So we have those on special days. So on uh, Wednesdays mm. and Saturdays, we have the peach cobbler. Oh, right. And mm -hmm. when we do that, when we let people know, well, they already know now, but when we it's, let them know, the line is crazy sellers. for the peach cobbler. Mm -hmm. and, and then the, the pineapple. pineapple paradise is mm -hmm. on and uh, so people Tuesday, at home Thursday, can Friday. smell this. Oh, my gosh. So yeah. It's coming so out. Y'all recently got married a few years ago, yeah. and now you're in business together. How has that been? It's great. Yeah. You're happy. <laughs> but you know, let me tell you're you still something. Still calling her Pookie? Still yes, calling every day. <laughs> every day, even uh -huh. if you're upset. You still call her Pookie. Pookie. Yes, Pookie. yes Pookie. all the time. Oh my gosh, you I'm trying this peanut, pineapple. This yeah. pineapple. What have you learned about each other through this process? Oh my goodness, that I need <laughs> to have more patience. Okay. okay. And yeah. I need to be very specific in my communication. Got it. Oh. <laughs> and I'm, I'm very, very OC. Very, I'm very detailed OCD. and specific. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Okay. Mm -hmm. and the you'll pineapple that. is delicious. Is it great? Listen, yes. we can't. I can't eat anymore. Okay. <laughs> it's so big.